Once upon a time, there was a dog with a very special message to share. This is Milo. In some ways, Milo is like any other dog. He loves his walks and playing ball and especially loves his food. He also has a best friend called Socks. However, one thing that makes Milo a bit different is that he grew up in a home where his owners knew and loved God. And because of this, he loves to help share the good news story with those he meets. This is Milo, the Gospel Dog. Sometimes life isn't easy, and sometimes we can get ourselves into a bit of a pickle. Maybe we get into trouble and end up in a fight. Maybe we make deals with people we know we shouldn't. And sometimes we do things that are just plain shameful. One of the devil's greatest tricks he uses to keep us from God and to make us sin is temptation. Some types of temptation are easy to say no to. Sometimes it gets harder. And sometimes it just gets unbearable. But if we keep our eyes fixed on God, then with his help we can resist it. Just as Peter kept his eyes on the Lord when he walked on the water, we will only slip and fall when we take our eyes off him. But God rewards those who put their trust in him. So many times we can feel like running away from situations or backing out of things, and we can feel like we're just going round and round in circles. Some people can spend their whole lives going round in circles, and then one day they die, as each of us will. Some may be peacefully in their sleep, and some may be, well, a bit more dramatically. But if they have forgot about Jesus, and never asked him into their hearts, when Jesus returns, as he will someday, to take his children home to heaven, they will be left behind. And Milo doesn't look too pleased being left behind. So make the right decision, and run to him today. To become a child of God, we must turn to him and pray, and ask him into our hearts, tell him we are sorry for our sins and to forgive us. Then with his help, we can turn over a new leaf and learn to walk with him day by day as we grow in our faith. We must also tell others about him and spend time reading the Bible and praying and going to church. Becoming part of God's family is the greatest decision we can ever make and then we can be sure of a home in heaven and will be kept safe in God's arms forever.